So this dress was pretty complicated. Let's, let's take a minute and talk about how this dress was actually made. First, I had to make a die so that every single penny in this dress could be re-stamped to say something actually meaningful. A few months ago, I had just built a 50-ton press, and it worked absolutely perfectly in this situation. So next, I needed to find a whole bunch of pennies, which, during a national coin shortage, was harder than I thought it would be to find. Every single penny in that dress had to get re-stamped. Every one. Every fucking one. All 1,100 of them, plus all the mistakes. Each fucking one. I am so done stamping pennies. If I never stamp another one, it will be fantastic. Every single penny needed four holes punched in it. So I retrofitted a foot press so that it could take punch size because punching them by hand got old really quick. Next, I had to weave all those pennies together, which took forever and ever and ever and ever. And hopefully I'm done making chain mail for the rest of my life because I want to do it again after all that. It was a lot of weaving, like a lot of weaving. <laughs> if you want to see more about this dress, go check out ladiesofiron.com. There's a little more info on there about it.